GPT-5 and human-like thinking chatbots are closer than you think. For the last few months, there have been rumors about the new ChatGPT-5, which promises to bridge the gap between AI and human-like thinking in unprecedented ways. GPT-5 will reportedly offer better personalization, provide more human responses, and handle broader range of content possibly even video. But until OpenAI's next model is released, ChatGPT 4 has been updated with some really cool features. So welcome to the beginning of a new AI era. And if you're new here, my name is Darius Lucas and on this channel we talk about creating an online business that gives you freedom, leverages AI and is connected to your ikigai, your reason for being. So get ready to get into the newest and the latest ChatGPT updates. And let's start with number one, ChatGPT's memory. According to OpenAI's blog, now you're in control of ChatGPT's memory. You can explicitly tell it to remember something, ask it what it does remember, and instruct it to forget something by a, a chatbot, by a conversation, or through settings. You can also choose to turn it off entirely. Usually, all the information is used to train the model and improve it over time. Memory has always played a significant role in how ChatGPT works, but lately, if you've been using the free version of ChatGPT 3.5, you might have noticed it's not performing as as well as it used to. And that's because ChatGPT get continuously trained on millions and millions of requests, including some that are quite nonsensical, and all of that lowers the quality of responses prompt after prompt. So one way to fix this could be turning off the chat history, which actually is super simple. To do this, go to settings at the bottom left corner and then click on data controls. There you'll see an option for chat history and training. Turning this off might help ChatGPT work better and preserve the quality of responses, no matter what prompt you use. In fact, as you can see, it says unsafe chats will be deleted from our system within 30 days. And now moving on to number two, multiple GPTs in one chat. As you probably already know, OpenAI has launched the GPT store, offering a variety of chatbots that you can use for practically every single task in your business. And they've also enabled us users to create our own chatbots based on our specific needs. And it's straightforward to use them. Simply open ChatGPT4 interface and click on explore GPTs. You can search a specific GPT if you have one in mind or just browse in the store. You'll find the top picks of the week and what's trending, including the most popular GPTs and chatbots created by the ChatGPT team and a bunch of other GPTs covering various topics such as writing, productivity, research and analysis, programming, education and much more. But probably the most incredible GPT's update is that you can now use GPT's in one chat window. And so for example, if I want to use, let's say my copywriting bot, I would prompt it as follows. I need the copy for my landing page. My product is an AI course about ChatGPT. Include pieces of news about how ChatGPT and OpenAI are changing the world. Use scarcity and mention that there are only five seats left in my course. Right after, in the same chat, I can ask my ex-growth bot to write an engaging tweet based on this text. Just, just type add in the chat and click to select your chat bot. This is basically like chatting with a team of AI bots that can help you automate each aspect of your task. This means that now we have all the AI functions packed in one chat. And this gets us much closer to what ChatGPT5 could look like. And now ChatGPT4 Turbo with Vision. OpenAI has recently updated the ChatGPT4 Turbo model, which is an enhanced version of ChatGPT4. It's trained on data until April 2023. It's faster, it can understand longer prompts. It allows you 300 pages of text in a single prompt. That's according to OpenAI. Even better, the new Turbo model is now available for paid plans, ChatGPT Plus, Team, or Enterprise. OpenAI claims this version has improved capabilities in writing, math, logical reasoning, and coding. And most importantly, it's more conversational and sounds more like a human being. Another cool upgrade is that the training data now extends up to December 2023 compared to April 2023 for the previous model. But what does with vision mean? It means that this model can now understand images and answer questions about them when you use OpenAI's API. So at this point, we have multiple bots 
chatbots interacting in the same chat. We have ChatGPT creating images and it has the ability to understand and comprehend images and analyze them. So what's the next big step? OpenAI has hinted at the release of their new big model, ChatGPT 5, possibly in 2024. And so we are also eagerly awaiting Sora, their first text to video model. ChatGPT 5 is expected to bring in faster responses along with audio, video, and other awesome capabilities. If you want to learn how to use a master AI this year, watch the upcoming video. In it, I share how beginners, freelancers, and small business owners can use AI for their businesses without being tech savvy. See you there.